welcome. This is the uh, 18th of May here in 2024, and this is the tabletop conversation, just yeah. spontaneously occurring down here at the boardwalk. Yeah, we're sitting on the bench looking out over the boardwalk. We've already had our walk, and our, our uh, we're gonna, after we get done with this, we're going to have a, a meditation in the car, and then we're going back home. Mm -hmm. and, and begin our creative day. Yes, indeed. So welcome and thank you for joining us. This yeah. is just um, something that we love doing per periodically by going yeah. on our walk down here at the ocean and just sitting down and taking in the smells, the sounds, the sights, uh, watching the people go past the and the pigeons that mm -hmm. are walking the and, handrail and we right had now. A surprise. We sat down on oh the yes, bench. that was lovely, and wasn't up it? On the arm, on the top, uh -huh. was this absolutely beautiful stone. Yeah. With somebody painted on it. Yeah, I painted a beautiful red heart and all oh, these and beautiful circles with dots circles. around it. And uh, it's beautiful. It's a gift. Yeah, and it is a gift. I'm gonna take it and keep it with me. Mm -hmm. I, I feel as an appreciation in this time we're trying to expand our life mm -hmm. into gifts. Yes. And and sometimes when you get most limited, it's like you really have to turn things around, and you have to take it into gifts. And 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 so like for us for over a year, uh, we only have uh, one car that mm -hmm. five of us use, mm -hmm. and 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 then also. Uh, Christina, one of us, she uses it most most mm -hmm. of the time mm -hmm. for uh, her delivery job. Yeah. And it goes all over the state, and it's really cool. But um, we usually only uh, get the car on the Saturday mornings uh, to go out, do a few things, and come down here, get a walk on the boardwalk. Otherwise, we just walk up to town, yeah. but not to the boardwalk. So on Saturdays mm -hmm. we try to make the most of it and yeah. venturing out and. But but it is there after a, a year there is a certain amount of limitation mm -hmm. that's felt with it. Um, uh, we used to have our own car and we used to travel about and, and paint different places and and also just have the uh, freedom to see beyond our house and yeah. <laughs> and we do if we're on foot. Mm -hmm. And but we've done really well with it. It's been a great advantage in the way that um, it gives it permission to be home. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And and if you're a creative, you know you need That's that. That's not such a bad thing. Yeah, it's not yeah. such a bad thing. And um, so it's, we've enjoyed it a lot of times. But now the spring's here, where we're feeling like we want to at least get to the ocean. Mm -hmm. And um, so we're figuring out things. Um, uh, we could walk down here, but it takes so much of the day to even get here. And and so I like to be here and walk. Mm -hmm. So how can we do that more? And we were thinking, well, you know what? We're now in the summer, in the spring. And in the spring, daylight is a lot earlier. Mm -hmm. So daylight is like, gets closer and closer to 4.30 all the time. The main, yeah. Yeah. So we realized that we could uh, coordinate it in a new way that mm -hmm. we could if we felt like it we could get out we could be up and out by six o'clock be up and out by six o'clock make our walk and yeah. and have our time and then have the car back easy by, by seven thirty. yeah yeah but so christina could then take the car on its next thing and then we also realized that when she gets home at five if we wanted to come down to the ocean or we all wanted to come down and have supper here mm -hmm. but get out a little bit that we could do it at that time of day all because through the winter and the fall the days are getting shorter um that really wasn't appealing no yeah no. so it's really cool we were talking about that newfound uh freedom and what would that bring to us why right? why would we you know want that early morning what does that give us mm -hmm. and uh it's gonna it, give us a lot so we, we've been talking about that because the more you talk about what it'll give you, the more it will get you up early enough mm -hmm. to have it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the uh, it's what you, what is it the, uh, what you want out of it, what you want to yeah. receive from it. Yeah, we're taking Did a new, a new class on mm -hmm. um, what through is Mind it? Valley. Mind is, Valley. Uh, that's but, that we wanted to help us uh -huh. uh, because we've begun uh, for the first time since the pandemic. 
uh, we've begun entering our creativity as a as uh, on canvases mm -hmm, and paintings. Mm -hmm. And and why do we want to do this? And what is it? You know, we don't even understand. We've already five paintings in, and uh, and we're now starting to understand why yeah. we want to do these paintings yeah. and what they have that's different from the other paintings that we have done. And lot, that's really yeah. that's timely because in this course that we just listened to a few uh, about twenty minutes ago was uh, with him saying with. Uh, the mind, the memory, the motivation, asking why you want to do something. So why is a very wonderful question of wanting to, uh, why are we wanting to paint again? Why are we wanting to get out early? These are all things that are, um, it's like the answers providing the questions for us right now. Yeah, we started uh, a group of, of classes uh, that are on uh, Domestica mm -hmm. that or were like forty dollars and now they're five ninety nine and mm -hmm. they're just what we need right now small mm -hmm. things that work with um, all the different levels of a body of work but a different levels of uh, moving your art into different directions yeah, yeah. and in writing and working and with it really fulfills that sense of curiosity that we have yeah because it's working a, with video always loving and, to, to talk to people about what they're doing or how they're doing something and that's what these videos provide mm -hmm. is their creative illustrators world. sharing their yeah, world it's how, a wonderful way to see then, that and um, then how to uh, take figures take your art make them in to characters and figures uh -huh. and work with three dimensional shape, figures that's going to be with, fun um, uh, theater and mm -hmm. and video and, and that's going to be a lot of it time. yeah a lot and of cutting video. out uh, creating th more things more 3d to go along with everything mm -hmm, and um, mm -hmm. and then we have all this fabulous uh, cover stock that we very nicely stored in mm -hmm. the little cottage uh, for four or five years, four or five years that was exactly. given to us and mm -hmm. and um, I think some of it came from Lynn, Lynn Donovan it was really uh -huh. and we put so. it all in nice containers it's all been kept really good and for all at once, we got an old uh, uh, bureau that Christina found, actually, uh, maybe on the side of the road. <laughs> Anyhow, <laughs> maybe. we fixed it, and uh, all at once, it went into the studio, and we were storing all that um, cover stock. And then as we were picking it up, we got so excited about it, and we realized it's part of uh, this body of work. Yeah, working and it, with. it also reminded me, I woke up this morning thinking about the using that and then remembering that Diane had given us those metal uh, flat files that we have up on the third floor. Oh my gosh. And that's got paper in it too. Oh my gosh. So we have a lot of supplies, materials huh. that we have at hand to that really delve into. Actually, yeah. And they're going to come forward. And yeah. we're so grateful for uh, all our friends that have helped mm -hmm. us over the years. Yes. Um, helped us get through really sticky wickets and have <laughs> helped us also feel um, encouraged mm -hmm. and help us with things that they uh, can pass to us that we can utilize. And we're, I think because of our fayness, we are very much a, a, a fay world and we live very much in a very fay way. And um, that's not always accountable. Mm -hmm. in this world because it's, seen it's so accountable small. with the people that love us huh yeah. it seems so small yeah but that smallness is immense and that's really what we're yeah. we're about is creating an immensity yeah even in a small space yeah, or space or taking one piece of work this week's book that we did mm -hmm. the flip book we did uh oh, it's wonderful we this week. took one painting our first the painting we have already done and we collage it into many different templates and then the content we heard from it mm -hmm. we put it around it yeah and so we took that one piece and and opportunized all its content into this book yeah that's how much is in that piece and we started realizing how much was in the other pieces and they're different they look different and they're different from some of the pieces we've done before there's a lot of coding and mapping and and, and really uh, 
fun but very unusual characters in it. Yeah, and if you want to take a look at that, um, since this we're recording here on May 18th of 2024, we're putting this public on uh, our YouTube channel. And uh, just to let you know that you can go see that flip book by going to sitchlacodex.com, S-I-T-U-L-A. C O D E X, all one word, com, our website. And if you go to Flip Books number six, that's where this issue that we're referring to is. So just look at the for the date on the, it was yesterday. So it would be mm -hmm. uh, dated as May 17th. Yeah. Flip Book. And, and this book is, I take into so much detail when you write a book, so much comes forward. Mm -hmm. And it's about that process. When you when you put the brush to the canvas, mm -hmm. it's in that moment that they touch, that you hear and then you move, and it's that way when we write the books themselves, mm -hmm. and it's that place that we live in, and it, it makes us not as um, available to a lot of life, mm -hmm. but we're available to another part of life that is tremendously valuable. Yeah. Yeah. and helps all of us get through the difficulty of this time. Yeah, and I think that uh, um, this is, uh, with this conversation right here, mm -hmm. it's unscripted. And that's the way our art is, too. It's an unscripted. It really is what you say, where the brush touches the canvas and it moves. Yeah. It's an unscripted, uh, free-form, organic expression that comes, yeah. comes because that's what, what we ask for. That's what we would love to be part of. And that's what we've joined together mm -hmm. in. Absolutely. It's so beautiful to have a partner that joins together in that. And I think I, I dreamt of that since I was a little girl. <laughs> yeah, me too. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I was telling the thing uh, when we were doing the class yesterday, which where we read the book and then we pull out from there a uh, further conversation. Mm-hmm. And uh, I realized that uh, in your life, it's like when I was very young, um, my ex-husband had uh, proposed to me. And I remember sitting, we were sitting up on top of a big hill looking out and, and I just told him, I said, because I did care about him, but I knew he wasn't my, he wasn't my part, my other part. And I told him, I said, that I told him that he would never be that, that he was not my, my prince. Mm -hmm. But, and he laughed, he thought it was funny, but it was the truth. And then finally, my prince did come and, um, and I did leave. And, and it's like, I lived my life to the fullest as as I was uh, waiting for that mm -hmm. and um, uh, I loved it but when it comes when that comes it, there's there's no match like it and uh, and now I am not farm wife but I'm an artist and a writer yeah and I'm creating with my match Mm -hmm. And I love it. I do too. I, I do, do too. too. So this is, you've joined us for part of our day, our early morning walk uh, out by the ocean at the boardwalk. And we um, just wanted to share uh, part of our creative life so that as you move through yours and uh, the kind of days you have, and days are up, up and down, that's just a natural flow. But it's nice to be able to sit into a sweet morning moment and share it with you. Yeah. So, yeah. Is there anything else? We'd... No. We'll okay. Just... Well, thank you for joining us. We'll Talk do these again. again. Later. Uh, and um, good day to you. <laughs>